welcome to my channel and today what we are going to be playing with is the Stila foiled pigments which I've kind of been experiencing with these a little bit and experimenting I think I'm trying to say and these are a little bit expensive they're $32 a piece but I really do like using them I think they always turn out really pretty um, especially for a fancy event. I love doing heavy glamorous makeup. I think it's probably some of the most fun looks for me to do. So I'm going to show you guys how I use my foil pigments and we're just going to jump right in and we're just, we're just going to get started. Alright, to start this look off I'm going to prime my face with my Hourglass Primer and just rubbing that all over my face with my hands. Next, I'm using my Matchmaker Foundation by MAC in 3.0, and I'm just applying that all over my face with my all-time favorite um, foundation brush by Sigma, the F55 maybe? I don't know. I'll have it linked down below if you are interested in any of the brushes that I use in this video or any of the products I use. going to be doing my eyebrows I have this whole tutorial link down below so right now I'm applying a base this is painterly by Mac it is a paint pot and it is my favorite one to use I use it in almost all of my tutorials and then for some reason my camera didn't film me putting cream all over my lid with an E40 brush by Sigma then I took the E38 brush by Sigma this is a crease brush and I added this matte color into my crease and this is the Lark Pro palette I was using here. Then I am taking the foiled pigment by Stila and I'm going to mix it together in the little tray with the solution that they give you and then I'm taking an eyeliner brush and I'm just going to pop this onto my lid and just make sure it's really packed on there tight that way we don't have much fallout. Then I'm going to be taking Brown Script by MAC and I'm going to be using an E45 brush by Sigma and I'm using it upside down kind of like I did in my last tutorial and I'm just really really blending this out well into my crease. Now I'm just taking a blending brush and I'm just going to swipe around blend that out and I'm going to look a little crazy here and then we're going to add the darker color which I'm just going to use plain black adding a teeny tiny bit at a time with a pencil brush into the outer crease. Being sure not to add too much color at once is how you're going to get this look without overpowering the black. Then I'm going to go back in and blend that out with my E45 brush from Sigma and I'm just blending it, pushing it forward, adding a tiny bit of color, and then just keep blending and working with it. Again, you never want to add too much color at once because then you end up with a big mess. Next, I'm going to take that cream color again and just going to put that onto my brow bone as my highlight. And for this, I'm going to be using an E20 smudge brush from Sigma. And then I'm going to do wing liner. This is the worst wing liner tutorial ever, but my camera got crazy and quit filming. Then I'm going to be taking my favorite concealer by NARS. This is the Radiant Creamy Concealer and applying it to the usual areas and then blending it out with my 57 brush from Sephora. Next, I'm going to be taking the color Banana from the Anastasia palette and applying that on top of my highlight with an F35 brush from Sigma. And then, of course, adding my contour using the usual Java and Fawn from that same palette. Next, I'm going to go ahead and smudge out the black color underneath my eyes and then I'm going to add the brown script color on top of that. You're going to want to make sure this is really really blend out that way your underneath your eyes won't look so heavy. Then adding the gorgeous hourglass blush onto my cheekbones with an angled blush brush. And next I'm going to add a shimmery color on top of my cheekbones just to give me a little bit of a glow. 
my all-time favorite lash primer that I am so, oh my goodness, obsessed with. I love it so much. I'm going to go ahead and apply this to my lashes and then I'm going to add some mascara on top of that. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to add my 105 Demi Lashes by Ardell. They are my favorites. And then we're going to do our lips. I am taking Myth by MAC, applying that. And now I'm going to take this gorgeous color by NYX. It's one of their butter lipsticks. I'll have the names of them listed down below. Then I added Chihuahua by NARS Lip Gloss on top. And we are completely done. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. I really enjoyed doing it for you guys. Please subscribe to my channel before you leave because I would love to have you to be a part of my YouTube family and follow me on all my social media. It is always listed down below. I love you guys to death. Thank you for watching. Bye guys.